Okay. See, this was, no, I can't do that while holding the camera. But I'm going to try and use silicone, this three in one silicone spray for a loop. I don't know if it'll do it. I'm going to mainly put it on the outside of the bolt and on the magazine. Uh, these H and H's were similar to the first Weatherbees, and they used a Mauser, Mauser 98 action. And so they're, I mean, they're a stout gun. Then they rebarreled them and put a different stock on them. Like these stocks actually are very ni nice wood, nice, nice uh, walnut, and European walnut or something. However, this is something I wouldn't recommend doing, putting loading data with some type of tape on your gun. This is like, this tape won't come off now. It's been on there for a long time. In a book, write it down in a book or something, or write it down on the powder, or write, just don't stick it on your gun. Like, man. And so this this wood needs to be redone. It'll, it'll be nice. Oh, also, they used Gorilla Glue to stick this butt pad on. Yeah. And it's it's spilling all over the place. It's coming out of the butt pad. And which stiffens up the butt pad and then it also is ugly. So I mean these stocks they tend to crack for some reason. I uh, sometimes they'll cry in the nineteen fifties gun, probably nineteen sixties maybe. And uh, so they used to have a swing out floor plate and they replaced it with this, with these mags, and this is really sticky. Kind of like the Remington 760s, uh, really sticky mags, and it doesn't really click in very nice. Bolt is is not terrible, but yeah, I mean, it needs to be cleaned and lubed, and I might even just see how this stuff works for for cleaning it as well. So, yeah, we'll uh, do a before and after with this magazine. See how it works. Okay, it really doesn't take very much. Yeah, it's, it doesn't smell great. So it uh, doesn't seem to be cleaning it that great, but it should be lube. And I, I silicone typically repels dust better than. Uh, with silicone oil better than other types of oils of that. Just on top of the plate there. A lot of people use WD-40, uh, which is a water displacement for maybe. It's 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 a little dirty. I might have to get some actual cleaner and do that. It was quite dirty. I ended up using some of this. Um, Pro Shot One Stop One Stop Gun Cleaner and Lubricant because it it has worked good in the past and so that silicone does not does not isn't a good clean it just makes stuff slippery and so I I cleaned it that's just from the mag well and and the outside of the bolt. And then I did a little bit in the, well, a little bit. I just stuck my finger in and went inside, inside of the action there. And it's not my gun. I don't, I don't feel like doing a, a real thorough cleaning, but I do want it to be, to work. And that, that magazine comes out real, it's, well, it snaps in, snaps in beautifully now. And it does pop. You have to pull it. I think. Maybe they are always like that, which isn't terrible because um, like the Browning AB3 is kind of like that because if you hit that accidentally, you're, mag you're not going to lose your mag. So don't mind it. And the fact that it snaps in nice is, is probably the most important. So there you go. And I did. So I did use the silicone. At the end, after I got it cleaned up, I, I used this uh, silicone spray three in one, just on the mag. I didn't I didn't put any more on the bolt because after I cleaned it up, it's I mean, it's working as good as any Mauser. Uh, the girl that is going to buy this gun from somebody else, <laughs> uh, she pulled it out. She said, is it supposed to be like that? And I said, Yeah, it's a Mauser. 
to Mauser 98, uh, they, they're like that. So, but once it's in there, it's it's good. Controlled feed. These have a real nice trigger. I don't know if they're all like that. These H H and H and H's. Um, I like the way it's curved around like that. It's kind of cool. And the the uh, there's a fly bug in me. It it's got about a three pound pull, but there's no creep. It's just it's not a two stage trigger. So they they redid the trigger and like most of those. Those old Mausers were uh, kind of a two-stage. You'd pull it, pull it, pull it, pull it, then you'd get a little bit tough, and then. So, anyways, yeah, not a bad gun. I think I don't think I think this is probably a good loop, but not a good cleaner. Okay, thanks for watching.